Welcome to In The Kitchen with Chef Dakers. I am Chef Anthony Dakers and this is What's Cooking for Summer Season 2, Episode 2. Last week, Chef Demetrius shared his summer recipe, grilled barbecue pigtail and also grilled chicken. This week in the kitchen, we have Chef Dewey who will give a little twist on summer recipe. He will be preparing his fish tea, that's Cheriosa fish tea. So if you want to see how this is done, stay tuned. We'll be right back. Hey guys, it's Chef Dewey here, and this is what's cooking for summer. Today I'm preparing a fish tea with chorizo. So different, but let's check it out. So I'm going to do a small dice, okay? I don't want the long strings of onion in your mouth when you're consuming this. So I put it as small as I can. And it also releases the flavor quicker. Right, cutting this on the bias, meaning slant. Give a different cut, seeing that we've been dicing stuff so far. Give it some, you know, for the eyes to look at. Guys, right now I'm about to kind of pan fry the chorizo. A chorizo is pretty much like a jerk sausage. You can use it for breakfast, you can use it for brunch, any summer vibe dishes. It's perfect in it. Yeah, so chorizo is pretty much a fatty, fatty sausage, so you need little to, less, little to no oil at all because it releases its own fat. I realized I probably put in like a tablespoon, a teaspoon, sorry, in this, and this is the amount of oil I'm left with. But so right now I'm gonna add the fish stock, but I add over here simmering for a bit. For me in the summer, as a young athletic, energetic guy. I used to play a lot of football, basketball. Basketball was my main sport from high school days. I was looking forward to this. I was looking for something refreshing afterwards. And then, you know, after high school, you decide to pursue your career. Pursue your career as what you're passionate for. I was always driven from in high school to be a chef. So my passion started off when I was baking in high school. It was mainly baking and I loved it. Loved, loved it. Especially from high school days, not a roommate, but I used to love mixing stuff with pastry. And I realized that I was a bit different from everybody. I was even told that. Um, progressing on this, following through my career, I started off with Brian Lumley in, in Boys Town. And it, the experience I got there, I wouldn't change it for the world. I'm currently working with him. Come on, come in. You're looking forward to exciting things, creative things. You can check out my page. You will see that, trust me. I have a lot going on that I need to post. So you can always check me out at chef.dewey. You will see all the amazing stuff on my page. You can shout me out if you want. Ask me for ideas as young culinary persons coming up in the field. Um, even just as stay-at-home cooks, you also want to do something different or surprise, let's say, your partner, um, your family, anyone at all, friends. You have a little cookout. Yeah, bounce it on me. They give you my ideas. All right, guys, so I'm going to add the carrot right now. And then right after the potato, add all the carrots. As much as you want. You can also add sweet potato if you want. A little sweetness in it. It would really go well with it. You can use dry thyme or you can use fresh thyme. As I already realize it's thickening because of the okra. And next two, three minutes, we'll have our soup ready to be consumed. 